Hi everybody, how are you? So in this video I will show you how to create a PHP command line application. Uh, the idea is, is just to demonstrate how to how to create the application and you can use uh, that for, for everything that you need. So the first thing is to create a PHP file. I will create the file with the name common common.php is my file I will delete everything here and one thing that that we, we, we need to consider is that this application will, it will just run on Linux so usually all the PHP applications are running in Linux so I don't believe that anybody that the, the, the most part of the people are running a PHP application in Linux servers. It's very uh, rare to see a PHP application running in a Windows server. So the first thing to do is to, to indicate that we will run this file using PHP when we will run this, this, uh, this file on the terminal. So I have to put here the director that I have my PGP installed. This will indicate to, to my terminal that she needs that he, it needs to, to use this interpreter to run uh, the file. So now we have the, the file and configure that this file will run using the uh, this PGP uh, director executable so now I have to go to the terminal and give and give execution uh, permission for this file because now I have the file but I can't run it if I come here and write command try to run the, to run the application I will receive the dynet permission uh, error so what we need to do is a ch mode plus x and the file name. Now my file can can be run. It. This uh, the file is printing nothing because I have nothing on my file. And now we will see uh, two two things. One thing is an argument an an variable and uh, another thing is another variable. Th there are global variables that I can use to get the parameters from my terminal. So if I come here and print the argc variable and the argv, what I have is in argc the count of parameters that I have received in this in this file in this script and the argv are the parameters that I that I received in in that file. I will print for for just for to see first to see uh, how the these were what what is inside these variables. So let's run without any parameter. What we have here is the one that is the amount of co uh, of parameter that we have, and the parameter is command that is the file name that I am running uh, now. So I, I will add I will add here a bridge line just to to be easier to us to say what is printing and now I will add by example a help a help argument it can be in any format if I want to put just like that you can choose in what format you want to put the, the parameters and how you can see here I have the, the, the count of parameter is in this case 2 and I have here the script name that is the first parameter and the second parameter is the second parameter that I have indicated and by example if I want to put here a uh, help 2 by example it's two parameters and help so I have to if I if I want to get the two from this parameter I need to parse uh, 
this parameter but it's very easy it's just a, a string manipulation and you just need to do uh, ifs and string manipulations not too hard the we are concentrating here how to to create an, an, a common line application so by example if i want to to create a, a help for this application what i i need to do is I will check if I have two arguments because if I have just one argument I have just the file name and if I have the file name I one thing that I, I want to do is to print my help because I, I want to show for the person that is using the application what, what the person can do and another thing or if the second parameter I I just using one parameter for this application. I do I will not ingress in in complexities. So I will just put here the minus minus help and else okay. So what I will put here is um, let's close the PHP here and let's open the php here let's close in the next line just to be more beautiful okay and now you start to to write this is this is a command line application use help get available 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 I, I am ah yeah that's right I am learning English so sometimes I am not sure how to write something available parameters parameters okay so and if I uh, put any other parameter, I what I want to do is to print what is inside the the what is the parameter that I that I have sent. It. And here I, I can do anything that I that I want. And let's print to a break line. Nice. So now I will just put the file name and I what I get is this is a common line application use minus minus help to get available parameters and if I put minus minus help I get the same thing and if I put by example create parameter I will get create so here what I can do by example is check if my parameter for example I can put if and check if my parameter is the create and I can keep in adding another conditions to do what I want to do by example if I want to create I can here create a new file I can um, I can do anything that I want so that is it uh, it's a very simple example uh, if you have any doubt uh, please uh, leave a comment and thank you so much to for watching this class bye bye